Hi guys, this is Sai Kumar Kurtiwada. In this video, we will learn about Ken Match Auth Guard, which is given by Angular. And what is the purpose of Ken Match and why we are using Ken Match, we'll see in this video. Actually speaking, before Angular 14, we don't have Ken Match. So, what we did before Ken Match, there are two things that is nothing but Ken Load and Ken Activate. So, whenever you want to load the children or not, that can be decided by using Ken Load. And if you want to activate a particular component or not, we can use Ken Activate before Angular 14. From Angular 14, they introduce one thing called as Ken Match. Actually speaking, what are the problems in our previous routings before Angular 14? Before Angular 14, we have a problem like a path should be defined with single route. That means each and every path should be unique. You cannot use multiple routes with the same path. Whereas can match will help us to write multiple routes and we can navigate to one route with one component and another same route with other component based on some conditions and that will be activated by using can match. We'll see this in real time. Let me go into my Visual Studio code. Here let me go into our routing part. In Angular 15 or 14 we have can match but before we don't have can match what is the problem let's understand now let me have a path called as home path and let me go with module ng generate module and the module is user home hyphen hyphen skip or hyphen hyphen routing and hit enter it will create a module with user home as a name and a routing file let me create one more module called as admin admin home for these two modules, I want to use a similar path that means home. Let me create two components individually ng generate component and the component name is user home and I am just keeping the test files. Hit enter. Now it created the user home component. Let me create admin home component and hit enter. Now it created two components and two modules. Now the case is I want to create one more module or component directly ng generate component and the component name is forgot and I'll just use skip hyphen tests and hit enter so I have three components one is user home admin home and the forget password now whenever I give a home and I want to load a children which is something like an import of dot slash user home slash user home module dot then and it is something like m implies m dot user module let me go into user module let me go into user routes and inside this routes let me give a default path that is empty path and the component name is user home component let me save this now if I want to use the same path like this for our admin home so let me change into admin home and let me change into admin home and let me change into admin home module let me go into admin home module and routing and inside this routing let me create a path and the path is empty and the component name is something like admin home component save this now it is admin home component and both have the same route let me create one more path that is nothing but star star where if it doesn't find any route this component will render and the component name is forget component save this now if I give a home in my URL which component will render whether it will render user home or whether it will render admin home let me check that now we don't have any path default path so it is going to the forget now I will just give user or just I'll give home now it went to user home now if we are giving the same path it is going only to the first occurrence of this path for example if I have my route configuration in this way first is admin home and the second is user home in this case it will only target for admin home let me go here it went into admin home but there is a situation where it should be based on the role that means whenever my role is admin it has to go into admin otherwise it has to go into user module that is my approach now let me check that what I'll do is just I wrote like this and in this case instead of using can activate and can load I can just use ng 
generate and let me generate a guard and the guard is role manager and hyphen hyphen skip hyphen test file and hit enter it will create a functional guard as we are using angular 16 it can create a functional guard and I am just selecting the kin match and hit enter so it created a role manager so let me go into role manager guard and I'll write some set of conditions over here so the conditions are let me get the role from our local storage local storage dot get item and I'll be getting this role if my role exists and role if it is equivalent to admin role then I'm just returning true or false so I'm returning a true else I'm just returning false so if it is not admin I'm just returning false what happens over here if I use this role manager in my route by using can match if it matches with any of the condition from this guard and if it returns true or false then based on the condition it will check the other routes for example in this case if you have an admin role in your local storage then it will load this admin home and it will ignore this user home now if it is vice versa for example if your role is not admin then this can match will fail and then it will search for the remaining stuff if the same route matches with another route then it will go into that module else it will go into forget component so let me check that let me go here now it went to user home why it went to user home I'll show you let me go into our role guard let me write console dot log of role just I am trying to print this role over here let me go here and go to the console if you see it went into inside your role manager it is getting the local storage value but if you see the local storage value we don't have anything called as role so let me add the role over here and let me add admin or let me add something like this admin so let me go here and just reload this if you reload now it went to admin home why because the role whatever we passed over here is admin so it is checking the admin role if admin role exists then it is just going and loading this admin home module if you go into your source and check the modules which are loading so for example in this case let me go into app and if you see here it is loading only admin module because you are using only admin even your source code is not getting loaded if it is not needed that is the reason we will be using can match can match will help us to load only respective paths and respective modules not only that it even helps us to manage two or three routes based on our can match for example I am here in the home I am making it as home one it doesn't have two routes if this route passes then good but if does not pass it will search for the remaining path of home we don't have that home over here and hence it will go into forget component let me go here and just use reload now I have the role that's why you are going into admin home let me go into application and just remove this now let me reload it went into forget works why because we don't have one more home path see here we have only one home path and that is also getting false so that's why it is going into forget password so always whenever we are trying to use can match it is our responsibility to use a path which is matching as a same and that is nothing but your default path and one more thing which you need to remember is whenever you are writing can match that should be your first priority so for example if I just put this can match below and go here it always goes into user if you reload if you add something like role and admin even at this case it will just go into the user home why because the router if it finds a path with a similar route then it will automatically load the respective component and ignore the remaining stuff so whatever the checkings you want to do you have to do in the starting and whatever the default path you have that can be in the last so that if all the matches fails then it loads the default path so that's about your can match and this is very very important to understand and from angular 14 plus can load has been deprecated and we are using can match can activate plus can load the combination of these two came it as can match it helps a lot 
at the source level as well as at the activation level hope you like my explanation if you like my video like share subscribe to my channel for more updates signing off thank you